It's part of all of us. Oh my god! What happened to your face? Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to my channel, everyone! I'm the Global Cherry, and today, for Spooktober, we will be playing Remothered. To keep the haunted entities away, subscribe, like the video, and share the video. I have never played the original Remothered game, from the beginning. so I'm not really sure what the story is about. Oh, so it's giving us a recap from the original game. A mysterious woman who introduces herself as Dr. Reed Rosemary visits Rosemary, the, the, the plant? Dory, Richard Felton, who suffers from a strange disease. He is assisted by his personal nurse, Gloria Ashman. Okay. After a brief and fruitless conversation, Reed is exposed as an imposter. She has come to the villa to find out what really happened to Felton's missing daughter. Oh, so this daughter, woman is an Celeste. imposter. After being thrown out and refusing to give up, Reed hides until nightfall and sneaks back into the villa to search for clues. As Reed explores the villa, she soon finds herself in the center of her worst nightmare. Oh! Richard Felton has killed his wife, Ariana Gallo, and has lost his sanity. He killed his Upon wife? Upon learning that Reed has infiltrated the villa, Felton and a mysterious red nun begin hunting Reed. Whoa, a red nun too? Eventually reaches the attic, where a mysterious girl who- Who are we running away from, really? ...is found looming in the shadows. Reed eventually discovers that Richard Felton and the Jennifer in the attic are actually the same person. Huh? Richard Felton was born as a woman, but was then forced by her cruel father to live as a man. Okay, that's Phenoxal, a very messed a up story. created by Felton, the Ashmans and Professor Wyman on the Rosagallo farms, was created from a rare breed of parasitic moths to repress and erase traumatic memories. It is revealed that the drug was tested on Felton and the nuns of the nearby convent. So one of those nuns must effects, be that red hallucinations, nun. Hallucinations, severe light sensitivity, and homicidal rage. As Reed was escaping Jennifer, Gloria returns to the villa and offers to help Reed. Gloria drugs Reed, and upon wakening, she finds Gloria forcing Felton to cut out his own tongue and burn himself to death. Gloria reveals oh, that she is oh, okay. the, nun, the sole survivor of the fire at the convent, which was started to cover up the Phenoxyl experiments. This Gloria story is been um, hypnotizing Felton for revenge. hauntingly intriguing. After a frantic confrontation, Reed manages to escape Gloria's murderous rage. Just before Gloria passes, she reveals that Celeste is still alive and that she had fled the Felton Villa years ago. Reed must continue her search for unanswered questions. If Gloria was the daughter of Felton's associates, the Ashmans, why was she used as a guinea pig for experiments in the convent? Who were the Feltons yeah, why? their daughter from? Who is the real what enemy here? To Celeste Felton? I have no idea who Celeste Felton is. Oh! Who are we? Where are we? How are we? Why are we? Let the hauntings begin. Are you suffering from a broken heart? Nope. My heart's doing pretty well. A war veteran. You must be suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder. We have the solution to your problem. Phenoxin. I'm not sure that's the solution to my problem. Moves your torment, be it an old traumatic event or a bad memory. That's a very Goodbye creepy advertisement. And constant churning over it. Forget about it forever. It's finally possible with Phenoxil. And that's what you call a scam. Monsters. Fucking monsters. Okay, I'm very creeped Memories out already. What is this game hand. setting? Oh! Why are the lights off? Uh, excuse me. I wasn't expecting for a jump scare this early. <gasps> ah! I just want to get What the fuck? <laughs> oh! No! Oh! How do I run? How do I? Oh! You, you didn't tell me the tutorial. That's the t 
title screen? This is the title screen. I'm pretty sure I just died. Game, why would you do this? And are you really suggesting that all this time, these people kept these experiments synthesizing this parasite? Yes, they the did moths keep this from us. That were carried out on the nuns at the plantation a secret, making them intentionally ill as if they were lab rats? Just Yeah. Has no one this really drug? looked for the drug? The Oxel. The farm, the moths. The hypnosis. And all those deep and dark family secrets. Family secrets are very dangerous. The most dangerous of any kind. The only way to survive was burying them so far down inside ourselves. And to move on. Richard Felton, Ariana Gallo... Professor Wyman. I have Ashman's no idea who son, these are, ma'am. Stefano and Gloria Ashman. I don't even know they who you are. And so did I. So you chose to forget. You had For Phenoxyl? 49 years. I left a part of me behind at that time. I did everything they asked of me. Forget. Oh, is she that girl we saw at the beginning but one of the day, game? That missing puzzle piece resurfaced. Like dirt stuck beneath your fingernails it is there and always has been sometimes it is a song a lullaby or a certain item but for me that missing puzzle piece was a special person a lonely one just like me ma'am i don't think it's time to compare yourself to a puzzle piece 1973 well, this game hasn't even given me a tutorial. I'm not on the yeah. phone. Hello? Who is this? Who's the man with the cigar? Mr. Ashman? Andrea. Who's the Ashman? Here. Shall I let her in? That nurse looks very suspicious. Go on. Sit down. Oh, did she break her you arm? Know why you're here, young lady, don't you? I don't know. Why don't you tell me? I'm just going to stand up. I'm not going to sit down. Oh, I did. I am willing to turn a blind eye to the money and the cigarettes. Don't be fooled into thinking that I don't know about them. But for everything else, I refuse to do so. This is not a tour Whoa. resort, nor Dude, a playground. Chill. Breaking an entry? Larceny! What plans did you have for that gun? For God's sake, Jennifer, tell me! I don't... Know. You're really going to yell at your patients? It seems you are a magnet for trouble. From what I'm reading, you caused a lot of hassle, especially at the Flemington Girls Institute. Other girls similar to you ended up straight in juvie. Did you know that? All I can oh, do is I wasn't aware of that. I can assure you, I never intended. Young lady, what are you running away from? You are safe here. Midterms, you can talk to life. Me about it. I'm serious. <sighs> Very well. We will have to talk about this again. Considering what has happened, I have made arrangements to give you new chores. You will help Eliza in the kitchen. But sir, Doctors are allowed to give their patients chores. Best. I've always done my best here. I seriously doubt that. When you become of age, you will do as you wish and as you see fit. But until then, you are under my care and you will do as I say. Oh, is he like her Run father? Along. <laughs> I'm oh, leaving. And by the way, Lindsay will no longer be a problem for you. Who's Lindsay? What do you mean? 
She insisted that I send you elsewhere. Instead, I have organized to have her transferred to another facility. They will be coming to collect her next week. You may leave. Oh, was she like a close friend? She looks very hurt by that comment. The bathroom in room number 212 has to be cleaned. Oh, and don't forget that you'll be helping Elisa in the kitchen after lunch. Okay. You've really done it this time. Make sure that the two of you don't get him agitated after his parents' death. Mr. Ashman Jr. did everything by himself here. Oh, so what he's her guardian. Dead, my dear. Like all those who grow old. And I'm sure the morning sped up the process. So they died the of old age. I don't buy that. Convent. Have you seriously not heard of it? The convent just went up in flames one day. Even this building was partly damaged. A dozen nuns died in that fire. Mr. Ashman's sister, Gloria, being one of them. That's terrible. They had contracted some sort of disease. They practically oh, Gloria, went blind. You mean the nurse? They had gone mad. And that Dr. Wyman? Sure as hell didn't help them. Poor girl. She was locked up in there by her own parents. Why? Hi, Jen. Oh, Andrea. I'll start with room 213. Oh, she looks friendly. I want to be with her instead. The nurse is creepy. Did Mr. Ashman have something to do with it? Shh! Lower your voice! You'll get us thrown out of here. We're not allowed to talk? It oh, seems wait! There's a glitch Mr. in here! Mr. Ashman had the bad habit of touching his little sister. Oh, God. Wait, what? Obviously. The parents didn't like this at all. So they sent him to a family relative in the north. Oh, Alabama. If it were me, I would have done the opposite. For him, the arrangement only lasted a few months. For her instead? Well, that's another story entirely. He had always been mommy and daddy's sweetheart. He has been a sweetheart to them indeed. Probably way more to his sister. Ugh. What's going on? Is she sleeping? I don't like that tune outside the window. Girl, where are you going? Don't look at the window or the mirror. That's where most creepy things start to happen. No, no, don't lean in. Don't lean in. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, jeez. You scared me. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ever heard of knocking? No way. It is so last year. Knocking is so Everything last okay? year. With Ashman? Of course. Fantastic. Never better. Everything is great. He got angry, didn't he? Why would you care, Lynn? Tell me. I was just asking. Asking what? It's none of your business. What are you talking about? You can't be upset with me forever. I'm trying not to be, but my arm keeps reminding me. Wait, what did she do to her? It was only an accident. Do you have any idea how guilty I feel? Jen, please. I feel so shit about it. I didn't want it to get to this point. I Why are the camera that. angles changing so fast? Ashman told me everything. What are you talking about? You suggested to him that I be transferred elsewhere. Is that what you wanted? Oh, yeah. You're really a bitch sometimes. A bitch who let herself be fooled. But no. In the end, you withdrew yourself. You didn't want to get in trouble. I didn't want to get in trouble. Well said. You think we would have gotten away with it, right? Go away, Lynn. Leave me alone. No! And that's you're, the end of their friendship. <laughs> Go away! <laughs> Jen, please! Open the... Fucking door! <laughs> door! Fuck you, Lynn! Fuck you! Oh, you dang! Know. That's like twisting the knife in the wound. We knew each other, but I was wrong. <laughs> Go away! 
away. I beg you. Oh. Why is the noise My God. a blaring I sound? Have to leave this place at once. Oh, okay. That's not pleasant to the ears. I'm staying in the closet forever. What is that note? What does it mean? If Go away. True, I don't like it at all, Lynn. That writing doesn't look like it will be from Lynn. What's the point of living in this big house when all the doors are locked? What's going on? Locked? This door has never been locked before. Is that the nurse? Why is it not, not showing her face? Oh, I'm exhausted. Why did I decide to play this game at night? It's time to eat. Who's that plate of food for? Who is that tray for? Who are you talking to? You are very suspicious, Andrea. Failed test, uncontrollable acarontia, proliferation, it was eating it alive. <laughs> ah! I know you like your meat rare, but not this rare to the point it's still alive. <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell did they do to you? What is that? Is that a bird? <laughs> you know that. Once upon a time. <laughs> Whoa, are you trying to stab me, nurse? It's part of all of us. Oh my god. What happened to your face? I can't run! I've been hurt. Run! Run! Frick! I'm hiding there. She can't find me. Ah! What the frick? Go away. Go away. Go away. Don't stab me. I thought you were supposed to be my nurse. What the frick? I'm definitely completely injured. Is she coming? I don't know. <gasps> this medical care sucks. You don't know I'm here. I will smash you in pieces with my own hand. <gasps> You really open doors so loud. Bye. Is this door open? Yes. Oh no, she's coming after me. Keep running. This must be the hotel's older wing, the one which was engulfed and destroyed by the fire. Is she coming? Oh, she went into that room. I'm not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing since that's the only door that's unlocked. Ooh, paper knife. Ooh, on a haunted scary night. While I take flight, I use a paper knife. Let's see if there's any available door. She went through this one, so it's better to not enter this thing. You make so much noise, girl. Hello? I'm pressing X. The door is not opening. This is so sad. Our girl doesn't know how to open doors. What's going on here? Did Andrea really suspect that someone was poisoning her? But... but who? I'm not going mad. I'm not possessed. It's in the air. In the food. They are poisoning me. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. But what about the murder tendencies? We have so many knives. Yes. Now I can stab the nurse multiple times. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh dear, what happened? Oh gosh! It's Andrea. Fuck. 
What the hell is going on with you, Andrea? I, I must warn the others. Okay, I'm gonna call her Moth Lady from now on. She creeps me out. I can tell you haven't been doing your chores, Andrea. Look at the moths flying around the laundry. Obviously not. Have you completed your chores? Obviously not. What's in there? You're making so much noise. Oh, what's that door for? No, no, fuck. Oh, why is she back again? I just want to ah! oh, what the frick? Why? Why? Why is both sides locked? Oh! 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 oh. Oh, I'm stuck! <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Oh my god! Stab her! Jennifer. You deserved it! Oh! Crawl under, crawl under, crawl under, crawl under, crawl under! No, no, no! She's pulling me back! Where were you? <laughs> How do you keep finding me? No, 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 no! How the heck do you keep finding me? Ow! 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 My torso! Did we do it? Yes! She's finally out the door! After 20 tries! This must be the hotel's older wing. The one which was engulfed and destroyed by the fire. Okay, you literally repeated what you just said? This game is giving me some serious Outlast vibes. What do you guys think? Let's go repair the electrical cable. Hello? Creepy moth lady? Ooh, noise from movements reduced by 10%. Yes, we're getting this skill. Whoa! What's going on? Did it save there? What's in this door? It's like the only door that's open. Open the pod bay doors. Oh, it's the same room she's working in. Damn. Can't make external calls, only to other hotel rooms. I wonder if Moth Lady heard all these noises. Because these phones aren't very quiet. Bingo. What now? I have to make sure not to get caught. Yeah, we better not get caught. This is the Krusty Krab, hello? It's coming from room 213. Who's waiting? That is all for today. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, and share the video. Especially if you want another episode on a horror game or Remothered. Thank you for watching, and that's all.